welcome back, guys. So as you can see, we've got just a couple unpeeled vets gathered here around the table. So we've got Paul, Marissa, KJ, Matt, Nicole, and Kate. So there's a lot of people. I've decided that instead of bringing on a guest like we normally do, I would just interview these lovely people and see what their inner feelings and thoughts are on pending G words. Um, so, without talking about that, because I think, okay, if everybody had to make a face right now to describe how they feel about graduating, just make it right, hold it for a few seconds, just right. Okay, all right, so that, okay, so now that you know how we feel about that, we're just gonna move on. So, what are some of your favorite unpeeled moments? I know some of you guys have been here longer than others, Kate's done a lot of weird packages <laughs> that have brought us a lot of laughs. What What are some of your favorite moments? Um, I mean, I've sat on the kitchen, kissing bench alone three times, and I went around in a hot dog suit. That was <laughs> I guess. I guess. <laughs> My and I said I'm alone a lot on camera, so all of those really added up. Did that like help you personally, like grow as a This has been a very right? cathartic experience. Okay, that's really good. So has anybody else had any experiences like that, or none to speak I, of? I loved uh, two episodes ago when uh, Sean and I were talking about uh, Lion King becoming like a new a action movie, and we had this realization: Can you sing as well as Beyonce while you're pregnant? And there was a moment of silence, like three full seconds. <laughs> and we all were just like, like that's a raven face almost. And then we just went back to normal conversation like it never happened. Wow. It was a very like that weird was a good out of body moment. experience. But was I that, would you call that cathartic for you? Definitely. Okay, <laughs> wow. So guys, there's some real things. You think that this is just a show, but there's some real things that happen. This is a lot. Does anybody else have anything else or we want to just keep rolling? I got to do the bend and snap on TV. So that was pretty good. Oh that was unreal. That, that was, was unreal. And you knew it, it quick. It, yeah. was, it was unpeeled. He unpeeled, yeah. let me tell you. Um, <laughs> all right, so being that, so all of us, with the exception of Nicole, we're all graduating undergrad. But Nicole <laughs> is a grad student, so she's like a little, she, that's why she was the one that smiled. <laughs> She knows what she's doing. So she's excited because she knows what she's doing. So what are you doing? So I'm living in New York City and I'll be working at Edelman, a PR agency there. Good for you. Nice. Good for you. Yeah. From West Virginia, Glad. so it'll be a big move. So I'm excited. All right. So you excited for it? Yeah. I'm excited. Looking for housing now. So. There. Mm, all right. Well, is there, how does everybody feel about the housing struggle? <laughs> show, show us a face for that one. <laughs> I love I'm still on the job <laughs> Exactly. So, still on the job That's just not fun for anyone at all. Mm. But going off of Kate just had, you know, a whole beautiful package, if I do say so myself, on a bucket list items. So going down the line, we'll start with Paul. What are some of your bucket list, Syracuse specific bucket list items that you either have or have not gotten to yet? Honestly, I'm surprised this didn't make the list in the, the package, signing the bell tower. Is that not a thing? Uh, Seriously? Like, do you want to go yeah. all the way, like, go up? Go all the way up, yeah. Like, there, I that kind of that. a thing. Are we, like, oh, I have no idea. Like, where, where, like, I don't want you guys to off bell tower. Oh, I have no idea. I need more clarification <laughs> on a bell tower. To be where, clear, I haven't done where it. Where and when? Like, where? Up in crowds. You just have to, like, listen in crowds. Oh, oh, like, oh yeah. Ring you can't like, get up there, though, I thought, right? It only stops, like, That's why it's on the bucket list. Clearly, somebody can get up there. The bell gets rung. Scale the outside of the building. All right, so we're going to get spidey senses. So we're going to just start rifling through the trash on on Marshall Street, because something's got to be radioactive in there, and then we'll just Fun. scale the building and Fun. sign it with something, so that's good for us. Okay, Riz? Um, something that I already have done is I stole a, can I say this on TV? Well, you're I saying it. <laughs> 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 I, I gotcha. stole a dining plate, or a dining tray, yeah. hall tray, and I sledded down Krause Hill. When did you do it? Freshman year. Wow. So I bucket did it right list, away. freshman. You but did you even know? <laughs> did you even know that you wanted that to be on your bucket list? Yes, you because I love sledding in Philadelphia. We don't have many hills. Um, so <laughs> when I saw that one, I was you like, said, "This, this is, is my needs moment to be in." All right. So this actually, guys, the cops are outside right now waiting for Marissa. But okay, I next. returned it. Um, <laughs> I did. would say, so I've heard that, I guess this is a thing, but those like water towers above yes. Manly, you can like go up there. Yeah, you like, gotta go. You like, can climb it. I've climbed yeah, it. Yeah, like I was like, that seems pretty cool. Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to say that. <laughs> All right, next, water towers. I actually had two. 
It was kind of uh, one I'm still working on. The first one is to be the first Weinstein child to graduate from college. I'm the third. You of are gonna crush that, that, that in a couple good. weeks. That's and then um, to leave this place better than how I found it. And how are we looking on that one? Deep. I think I have a long. Can time you just like? All right, well you got All right, Nicole, throw us a quick one. Only been here years. I don't really know that many like secret stuff. Like I didn't know the kissing or. Yeah, you should. You're not supposed to know that. But um. I want to visit the Carmel Anthony. Um, there you oh, go. It's that awesome. feels achievable. Awesome right there. Can't I've give me one more, because why not? Go to the quarry on South. Same. All right, right. there we go. There's, There's a, a lot of things that we want to do, obviously. And I think we could, I mean, if there weren't so many of us, we could literally do this forever. But apparently I'm not allowed to do that. So after the break, we're all going to see if we can remember some of the most ridiculous things that we've said on air during our time here at Syracuse Unfield. So don't go anywhere.